So what's the big emergency? Someone die or something? Your guess is as good as mine. So you don't know anything? No, I just got a text from Ricky saying to meet here as soon as possible. Yeah, I got the same one. Ash, anything? Nope. And everything's clear on social, so it's not about anything happening online. No, of course. No, you have my word. All right. All right, thanks. Take care. You want to tell us what's going on, Rick? <sighs> Look, it's... It's Othello. He's trying to trade you. Excuse me? Look, there's a lot of backstory here, but... Yeah, the bottom line is Othello's trying to trade you, and we all need to talk strategy. Oh, I got plenty of time right now, Ricky. So how about you just backtrack a little bit and tell me exactly what's going on? So I know with how you know all that. Look, I, I can't tell you all that, man. Look, this is like some deep state office politics, but look, just trust me, the intel is solid. And that intel is? Othello feels Freddy's trying to replace him. We're talking about Brandon marketing, Freddy? Yeah, Brandon marketing. Yo, bro, Freddy. that is insane. Dude is not even a basketball guy. Yeah, you know that. I know that. But from Othello's perspective, he feels like Freddy is Phil's right-hand man, which means that he's in his ear, which means he can recommend firing him. You know what they think about each other? Not exactly best friends. <laughs> yeah, that's putting it lightly. Look, right now, Othello feels threatened. And when a man like Othello feels threatened, he lashes out. So what does that have to do with me? You're Freddy's pet project. Look, with you gone, Freddy's whole reasoning for being here disappears. But I thought they brought him here to, like, modernize the marketing department or no, something like that. No, that's mostly for the media. Freddy's an A-plus marketing guy, but the real reason he was brought on was to solve the MP problem. Don't, don't, don't. Wait, wait, no, no. What? Oh. MP project? Oh, what, what is that? Yeah, don't get emotional. My point is, if you're gone, it means that Freddy failed to sell you to the fan base. And if Freddy failed, that means that Phil failed. And if Phil failed, somebody's going to pay for that. It's not going to be Phil. Look, look, just... Right now, Othello's trying to consolidate his power. I mean, think about it. With Freddy out of the picture, that's just one less person who can question Othello's way of doing things. What are you thinking? If he wants to trade me, let him trade me. Whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. If the fans don't want me, my own organization doesn't want me. Why am I even here? You don't mean that. No, I do. How many times am I to get told that I'm not wanted before I take the hint? Look, it's MP, not... I know that this is a hard pill to swallow, but you're looking at this the wrong then way. how should yeah. I be looking at it, Ricky? How? As, as one man's opinion who's out of touch on the modern NBA player trying to desperately save his job. One yeah. man, an entire city. What is the difference no, in no, this no, case? No, 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 The fans are the fans, and you know you are well on your way to winning them over. Winning cures everything. Remember that. And what about Othello? Okay, yeah, that, that situation is a little trickier to navigate, but you're not powerless here. Okay. So tell me. What power do I have in this situation? You can fight back. Look, if Othello's the only one trying to ship you off, then he's creating a you versus him situation. Okay. Make it so he has to leave, not you. And how do we do that then? There are ways. Yeah. See this? This is a PR problem. Othello wants to trade you? Fine. We're gonna make sure that everybody knows that he's doing that out of spite and paranoia, not for the good of the team. If we can make your case persuasively, we can get the press on your side. Mm -hmm. And once national press starts calling for a GM's job, very rare that they survive. You know what, guys? I appreciate all the fun little cables you have planned for me. But like I said, I'm good. Wait, if they want to trade me, let them trade me. No, MP, think let about them trade this. me. And Pete, wait! What? We have a date tonight, remember? Listen, City Mina, View. I'm not in the mood for City View right now. Okay, I get it, but I just think it would be good for you to take your mind off all this for a second. Fine. But I just want to be alone right now. Okay, it's understandable. Why don't we just meet up there after the game? All right, that's fine. Hey, we're gonna get through this, okay? I love you. I love you too. All right, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to this 2K23 my career. We're going up against the Pelicans. Let's see if we can grab a dub. I don't know when this is going to be uploaded. I don't know what cutscenes are going to be before this game as I get fouled, but I know I have a bunch of cutscenes. Um, recorded with obviously no gameplay because there are a million cutscenes in this game. Um, so I don't know because I've been playing the game like cutscene wise, like doing the story besides the main story on my own. I'm only showing you guys the like big 
big cutscenes. Like, I'm doing the business district and all that, and obviously the business one and the clothing one, I'm not going to show. The only one I'm going to show is uh, J. Cole, because that seems like the only one of interest. As Zion, with a step, wow, on the fast break, can I hit, okay, I'm not going to take that three, because that'd be stupid. And I got Valanchunas jumping, but he blocked me? That was a lucky-ass block, bro. Good defense, Jabari. I'm down court. Jabari, I'm, I'm open. Okay, I did not want to sidestep there. But it's the animation that... Jabari, come set the screen, please. The animation that I got. I'm going to kick it out to Jabari. Come on, shoot that. That's a bucket. Our biggest issue on defense is the center play. Our big man can't do nothing. We have probably the least rebounds in the league. We give up the most offensive rebounds because we have like six, what is he, like six, 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 seven Marquise Chris playing our center position while Sengun's off the bench. Sengun's a high overall, by the way. So I really don't know why Marquise Chris starts, but he does. That's going out of bounds. But yeah, the center play is just so bad. That's why I want, to, I'm getting subbed out. That's why I want to finish this big uh, story mission thing. Uh, so I can influence trades and influence free agency. We're only up by six now. Uh, so I can... And adjust the lineup so I can get some sort of center. Because we don't have one. Same thing with the small forward. Even though Eric Gordon's still hurt. We still... David Nawal is our small forward. So our small forward play is also kind of just like out the window. Small forward and center. Definitely big uh, needs of ours. I am down court. That should be an easy layup. I thought it was going to be a dunk. I got Carol Lewis and Alcatraz right now. Come on, Marquise Chris. Oh, no, no, no. That ain't no way that's going in. It almost did. And we have team takeover. And I am almost turned the ball over immediately. Uh, who is that? Trey Murphy? Nah, nah, nah. Jalen Green, come set the screen. Let's get you some points. Let's get you some points, Jalen Green. To the basket. I was going to say to the paint. Oh, God, I'm not paying attention. Uh, control Gerald Johnson. Let's let the CPU play a defense. We got team takeover. Gerald Green. It's only Dyson. Okay, this is where I'm controlling. This is where... Hey, you know what? Good... Never mind. All right, I'm getting subbed out. Up until halftime. Come on, Bench. I know you're not good, but please. Only up by seven. It's because 2 case in love. Like, madly in love with the Pelicans. Kira Lewis with the ball. Going straight to the basket. And... How did I foul there? I all oh, I didn't even jump. I just put the stick up. Okay, that's that's just bogus right there. Yeah, okay, ball don't lie, even though they go back to the line because we have no rebounding. Yep, and they greened it. This is fantastic, bro. I knew I'd be subbed out. The bench is gonna blow this lead. I already know it. I already know it. Yep, we're down by three. Awesome. I got the steal. I got the steal. First three of the game. It's a green. Finally, I'm not shooting below 50% from three. More like below 30% for three. For like the first time in my career. They also got Brandon Ingram playing the point guard. So they're running a very... I can't even say... Oh my God, what a block. By Jabari Smith Jr. We immediately have the lead right back. 27 points, 9 assists, 3 rebounds. Don't look at the turnovers. I believe I have a block, too. Uh, so, that's cool. Uh, my first block of my career. It was on Kira Lewis, who is going to throw up the floater and miss. But Zion Williamson going to get the offensive board like usual. Like, seriously. 2K thinks the Pelicans are legit better than the 96 Bulls. The 2017 Warriors. It's just sad. And one. At 35 points, I'm pretty sure any like one or two points is a career high and i'm gonna get blocked i thought oh jalen green why would you not shoot that why would you not shoot please give me a there we go okay that's a career high but jalen green you were wide open for three they also have 16 second chance points that is a lot because of the offensive rebounding but bro was open wide open for three and decided not to shoot and jabari smith bit on the pass that was good defense though and we have a six-point lead, 140 left. If we score here, that could possibly be it. And they have Zion on me, so I'm going to put Jabari in the post. 
almost committed a turnover. That might be game if they don't score. 30 seconds left. They're down by six. Come on, Jabari. You just got absolutely bodied by Zion, bro. Oh, my God. And they're going to play the fouling game. And we are going to walk out of New Orleans with a big win. 109-105. Beating 2K's prodigal son over here in the New Orleans Pelicans the past three years. Ever since Zion got drafted, the Pelicans have been OP in this game. Fantastic game by Gerald Johnson. 42 points, 4 rebounds, 11 assists, a steal, and a block. And I shot 100% from three. One for one. And I get 90 over all that also means I unlock Rebirth. And I got a defensive badge. And Floor General Challenge. Congratulations, you now have the ability to, to core the Bronze Floor General Badge. I don't know what that means. Um, but yeah, big game for Gerald Johnson. Press conference time. You already know it. You already know it. Get up there, Gerald. I'm going to skip this because I don't care. Hey, Nate. What's on your mind, man? Wait, 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 wait. Let, <laughs> let me guess. You got some questions about my leadership since you didn't reach out for comment. I mean, really, while we're both here, why not? I mean, you tell me your side of the story. So we're at the part of the story. I didn't show any of this, but my leadership is getting questioned. Um, so he's asking a question about that. We'll go with the general. You know, man, I'll say it, it's very disappointing that whoever gave you those quotes didn't feel comfortable to come to me directly. Because I always welcome feedback, and everyone knows that. But the way that things came out, I, it makes me believe that there was like some sort of ulterior motive behind it. I'm like, what do you mean? So I don't know. I mean, maybe you could find out. I mean, you're a great reporter. <laughs> so, so you don't agree that your leadership has been lacking? I mean, I'm real with myself, man. I, yes, I could always improve, but I'm leading the same way I did when we won a national championship. It's proven to work. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> At a lower level of competition, though. <laughs> Listen, man, we all take time to adjust, but I'm going to get there. Trust and believe. Thanks, man. Mm -hmm. All right. That's it for today. Until the next time, y'all. All right. I guess that was all the questions. Yeah, so to keep you up to speed, this reporter leaked information saying I wasn't a leader. Blah, blah, blah. I called him out for it. It is what it is. Leave a like, guys. Enjoy. Subscribe, guys. are new. GG.